Yes, it's true. I am going to return the S23 Ultra in red, and here's why. Here I have the S23 Ultra in red and green. I have the standard S23 in uh, cream, and then I have the bespoke flip right here. When I typically pre-order, I do two. I do one in regular uh, color options. You can get pretty much any time, and then I do a bespoke edition. Uh, if you remember with the flip phones, they went on a serious back order for uh, quite a while. So mine were delayed about only about a week, but a lot of the others went delayed a long time. And right now, if you try to get a bespoke edition S23 Ultra, you're looking at the end of March. So I do it early to try to get a hands-on and get an unboxing uh, out and try to see which ones are gonna be the most realistic to the photos. Reason number one, this is not red. I talked a little bit about in my unboxing video about how much I like this red color, but in here in the studio, I have a lot of lighting and it's not really a natural lighting environment, so it's hard to see justice, but if you've seen this one in real life, it's much more of a coral color than it is a red color. Also, I did do a, hang on, hang on. I posted a comparison video of these two colors on my Twitter and on my Instagram. If you haven't followed me yet, that'd be awesome. It's at Maddie the Techie one. This is the red S23 Ultra, and this is a red mug. I mean, you can clearly see the difference there. It's more orange meets coral. So I want this, not this. But that is the first reason. I don't feel like the images at all really line up to what the real color is gonna be like. And even though I love this two-tone with the black, on the side and the really bright, vibrant back. Uh, it's just not doing it for me. That's reason number one. Reason number two, these sides are a matte finish. When I am not using a case, which is pretty often because I don't use a case when I'm at home, I only use it when I'm going out with the kids or running errands or traveling or something like that, I use it without a case. Now, if I have this case either face down or face up, doesn't matter, I go to grab. These rails on the side are super slippery. Um, and I think it's because of the matte finish. It just, it can't get a good grip on it and so I find myself fumbling with it more than I should. Now if I look at the green color, this is the green color here and uh, if I were to do another one I would go bespoke gray because I think that's cool and a little more neutral but you have the shiny polished edges here and this is much more conducive to picking it up where I feel like I have a good grip even now, I mean, this is, this thing isn't going anywhere. It just feels a lot better, and uh, for me, builds a lot more confidence when I'm using it without a case. Now, I have a screen protector on it, the one that they sell. It's meh, right? But, I mean, for the time being, might as well just use it. Those are the two reasons why I decided to ditch the red S23 Ultra and stick with the green. If you guys have any thoughts or comments about that, I'd love to hear it about what you thought of the red, what you think of the lime. I'm really curious to see the lime in person because online it looks really bright, but I've seen a couple of videos and pictures of it. I'd be curious to see what that, that looks like. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I wanted to give you my thoughts on the red after about a week and a half of using it, what my uh, impressions are, and really why I think you should go with another option, whether it's going to be the regular colors without the matte finish or something like the bright blue or uh, something else that has a polished rail on it. I'd love to hear what you guys think in the comments below. Let me know if you have the red, if you have used it, if you agree with me that it's red and not really red red but you know overall I'd love to get a look at some of the other colors in person like the blue the lime etc in the meantime go with the original colors you can get them quicker they have this polished rail on here which is gonna be a lot more comfortable to hold and uh, you know really much more available as well a sub would be awesome if you guys are liking the content and uh, we have a lot more to come a lot more cases and I got some iPhone accessories coming up as well stay tuned for that but until next time we'll see ya bye